I was talking to my friend the other day about a YouTube video they were about to, uh, about to post, but it, it needed some editing. And it had me thinking, it had me thinking about the shift in YouTube videos recently. Raw, unedited content is everywhere. It's absolutely everywhere. And audiences seem to love it, but why? Why are the creators ditching polished edits for this new, I don't know, unfiltered approach? Today, let's break down the no editing style and why it's changing YouTube and the YouTube game that we know, like the, the YouTube game that we know it as. So what do you mean by no editing? I mean, like, what do you really understand when we talk about no editing? Because I, I don't mean like completely no editing, I mean, but in essence, it's about the minimal cuts leaving in the moments. It's about the minimal cuts leaving in the moments of pause and, and all the extras, the bloopers, maybe my child's walking through the video, right? The appeal lies in its honesty. Simple as that, right? The shift to no editing isn't just random. Many photographers, sorry, many YouTubers have, many viewers feel the fatigue by this over-polished, perfectly edited, straight for TV, straight for movie kind of feel or, or scripted to, or, or even staged. People crave that human connection, seeing creators' genuine self. Mistakes at all. I made a couple just now. Makes them feel more relatable, to be, to be honest with you, right? Another reason creators are embracing the style, it's, it's way faster to edit this way. It's, especially when you're trying to get more videos out much quicker. The fewer edits means the faster uploads, which of course means more likes, more views, more engagement, quicker, right? My schedule is tight, got the two kids, married, got the job, and I'm still trying to learn this YouTube thing as well. And, and getting into those, or getting into that part where I want to try to spit out content as quickly as possible. I, I can't be always having these well-polished 20-hour video edits. Imagine having a timeline full of cuts and transitions versus one continuous clip. Like, it, it, it's so much easier. That time save can mean the difference between an upload weekly or even daily. And I want to talk about those weekly or daily uploads in another video, but let's go back here. Now, the question is, does this hurt your style or does this hurt I want to get that part. What was that? Now, the question is, does this style hurt viewer retention? Surprisingly, not always. People often stay longer because it feels more real. There's a, there's a conversation happening between me and you right now. It's like talking to your friend rather than watching perfectly edited TV, right? And some of the analytics back this up, showing that no editing videos or that no editing videos can keep people watching longer. But no editing isn't fit for every type of video. If there's a video with too much rambling or you lose focus, it can turn views away. So there's always a, a, a balance that you need to strike between genuine engagement or, or engaging without dragging on. So is this style right for you? If you're aiming for more connection and, and want to save editing time, it might be worth it. Worth exploring some of these really cool things. Some viewers may connect more with your authentic self than the more polished version of yourself. Are you a fan of this raw style or do you prefer something more polished? Let me know, let me know in the comments. And if you're new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more content. 